So, you know how they make simulator games out of everything? Well, it's time for another one. What's up, guys? Steinbot here, and today we're going to be playing Clock Simulator. That's right. You're seeing this right. This is Clock Simulator. So let's have a look at the options menu. It's got resolutions. Many of them. It's got full screen on or off. It's got low, medium, high, and master race qualities. Display options. English or Polish a volume slider, a mute button, and controls. They're not rebindable. Get over it. There is this, your total time, your total clicks. And there's this, play. So we can learn how to play. We can play a game of shadows. We can play the fragility of time. It's clock time. We haven't unlocked these yet. There are a lot of these games and more coming soon. Let's jump in and look at a game of shadows. Take your time. Time your actions. So, yes, this is a clock simulator. We are a clock. And I'm simply left-clicking. What I hope is every second. We'll know how badly I'm doing because the clock, wor or the uh, second hand will start getting shorter. So if you have a poor sense of time, this is maybe not the game for you. As you can clearly see, my sense of time is terrible. But, we might make it all the way around. Look at that, we made it to a minute and one second. Now we unlock a new stage. So this is how this game goes, guys. You play a stage, and if you do well, it'll generally unlock one for you. So let's let's try the spirits with him. This one's going to be new to me. Can you summon all five spirits? I feel like I should be playing this with a uh, stopwatch. It's an interesting game as far as the aesthetic goes. It's very simple. Got that kind of modern clock look to it. I would hope it looks like a clock, but it's also got some weird audio. Very accurate clock sounds, so I will give him that. So, just left clicking. I don't think there's a lot to comment on about the gameplay at this point. It's Extremely simple and self-explanatory. I'm clicking every second as a clock. In fact, I'm not really sure what I'm doing with my life with this game, but... I'm assuming we've summoned three spirits now. We are doing quite well for a while. This game actually really makes you realize how shitty your sense of time is. Wow. New clock unlocked. Okay. Let's take a look at some of these other stages. That's one thing I would I definitely appreciate about this game is there's so many um, stages out here. Go hand in hand with time. This one appears to be, yes, this is basically a rhythm game. Which means we could probably do this for quite a while. So this is 99 cents on Steam, um, honestly. For 99 cents, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. Let's take a look at one more. Probably my favorite one. We're almost, we've almost unlocked this one. You can see that the clock faces show you how long you have left. But 
This is probably my favorite one. This one's just funny. So we're going to press QWORP and a nod to Quop. So save our poor piggy friend. It's harder than you think, and the noise he makes is heart-wrenching. You also only get one chance. If you mess up, that's it. Ah, uh, what else do we have? Uh, we did the fragility of time. Did we do the fragility of time? I don't remember. See, you see how bad I am at this. And I lose. So, uh, one thing I will complain about is there's this in the beginning of the game. And it's very, I think, misleading. Not misleading, but for me, it doesn't work. Because, you know, this is training me in a certain expected fashion. And this is not how the game works. So, um... <laughs> I don't want to replay the tutorial. No, thank you. But I don't know any other way that you would do the tutorial, so, I mean, I shouldn't complain too much. Um, it's certainly interesting, like I've said. I'm all for kind of unique, maybe artsy, interesting, random little things on Steam this certainly fits the bill. And I think I'm doing better while I'm talking and not paying attention than any other one that we've done so far. I'm kind of curious to see what other games they'll come out with for this. Or modes, I should say. Um, yeah. It's surprisingly relaxing. And now that I've started concentrating on it again, I'm screwing up all over the place. What happens if we just... yeah. Hey, we unlocked Pig Got the Rhythm, though. Let's close out with this one. So let's see about Pig Got the Rhythm. Oink, 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 oink. What is this obsession with pigs in this game? Well... I could do this for a while. Because if that thing revolves once every second, it's not ever going to change. In fact, I could probably get one of those little rocking bird dipper things like Homer had in The Simpsons. Time it out for a second, and then just walk away and have a ridiculous high score in this game. Let's get to a minute and see if it changes. Mm, okay. Fair enough. Alright, guys. So, yes. Clock Simulator. It is absolutely a thing. You guys should pick it up if you're really bored. It's actually not horrible. It's 99 cents. So, I mean, I think that quap time alone is worth it just because it's hilarious because you can smash a poor piggy against the screen when you can't read button prompts correctly and yeah that's really all I have to say about clock simulator I I'm recommending it and I'm not quite sure why but every so often you just need that one weird game so Go check it out, guys. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, maybe hit like and subscribe. It helps out the channel. My name is Dimebot. I will see you next time.
like what you saw, click subscribe so you don't miss anything, or click on one of these other videos.